your host for the greatest story ever told. WAIF is your very own community radio station. Serves only to open its airwaves to responsible, divergent points of view. The opinions expressed on this program do not reflect those of WAIF, other staff, the Board of Trustees, or other programmers. The opinions expressed are my own views, those of my co-hosts, or those of my guests. All right, and that being said... We do have Taper Jesse. He'll be in a little, little bit. And uh, we have a Strange Mechanics release party. Some of you guys may recognize them. They stopped in a couple times over the last couple years on a Cincinnati band. Uh, they have their first album out. He's going to pop by a little bit later, drop it off so we can get a sneak peek of this thing. I really enjoyed having them in a few weeks ago. You can find that show on YouTube. They have about 198 or 200 ish shows uploaded for your listening enjoyment. Find Ramblin Rob on Facebook. I'll become your friend and let you know what's happening here on The Greatest Story Ever Told. Well, before we get on rocking with a lot of Grateful Dead, as usual, I um, wanted to let you guys know we uh, are in the middle of member I'll be playing that here in just a second. But uh, in addition to what you're going to hear about member we have two special de- deals going. Uh, the $150 level gets you a brick, yes, an engraved brick, here at the WAIF Plaza. You'll be uh, immortalized forever in front of our studios for just $150. That's right. And if you do, I'll just throw it in. And if you do become that $150 pledger, bricker, I will let you uh, come in here with Jesse and myself in studio on a Thursday night, pick a playlist. We'll sit you down here and uh, let you be on the radio. What do you think about that? Yeah, that's all it takes. It's just you get a brick and a little shot here on the radio. Rambling Rob Taper, Jesse approved playlist. Get to be your own DJ. I'll upload that to YouTube and share that with your great grandchildren. I'm sure you're going to. Okay, well, let's roll right through. Uh, we got some feedback going on here from uh, sounds like about 1968. So, anyway, uh, real quick, in 1967, The Grateful Dead played at the Kaleidoscope Theater, Hollywood, California. 71, Bucknell University, Lewisburg, Pennsylvania. 1972, the Tivoli Concert Hall. That was in Copenhagen, Denmark. That was a uh, TV broadcast, and that was the first He's Gone. 1982, Glen Falls Civic Center, up in beautiful Glen Falls, New York. 1984, the Hampton Coliseum, Hampton, Virginia. 85, the Irvine Meadows Amphitheater in Cali. 88, the Rosemont Horizon, Rosemont, Illinois. And 1993, the Sam Boyd Silver Bowl, Las Vegas, the last time the Grateful Dead played on today's date. Okay, well, speaking of today's date, we do have some guests come in. Like I said, the uh, Strange Mechanics uh, are going to have an album release party tonight. I'm going to hopefully get that in my hot little hands and play you some of that. Uh, and then uh, rolling into the uh, latter part of this month, we have Terrapin Moon stopping in studio on the 28th. And also going to be doing a phone interview with uh, Jared Stone from the New Stew. Uh, it's kind of one of those new super groups in case you guys haven't had it. It's Jared and a couple other guys. Let's see, I know Corey Glover's in it from uh, Living Color and also is in acting things a little bit um let's see here um also in may ben clunch on the 5th may 12th uh misty mountain string band a possibility and uh, next week maybe the tillers still working on that uh 26th of may we'll show uh we'll show the restless leg string band another good time in cincinnati yeah that's gonna be a cool one um and then on the 9th of june nick sudbury back in studio June 30th, Brian Isles guest DJing. And on the 23rd of June, we have uh, Tristan Brook in studio. A great young musician. I've heard a couple times. I always enjoy hearing her play. Well, um, uh, we got some rare and different tunes tonight. We're going to be featuring a Mickey and the Heartbeats show, uh, a song from it in a little bit, uh, probably in the second half of the show. Uh, we have a special guest on that show, I think, was a Jack Cassidy. I think I'll do some research on that. But um, yeah, Jack Cassidy's birthday. Happy birthday. Also, some hot tuna coming up a little bit later in the program since they, uh, they're coming around. At least Yorma's is coming around. So, always excited to hear those guys play. Okay, well, let's see. We got uh, a lot of Grateful Dead on the menu. Uh, and then uh, we're going to get some jam band news on in just a second. So, you guys enjoy this next little block. <laughs> Thursday nights 
from eight till ten. Eighty-eight point three wave FM. Tune on in, yeah, and feed your head. Always awesome tunes and always grateful dead. Yeah, Ramblin' Rob, well he's your host. Streaming on the web from coast to coast. Check it as you do from shows of old. It's Ramblin' Rob's greatest story ever. Thank you for tuning in to listener-supported WAIF Radio. We're in the middle of our fall member-thon. Help keep WAIF Radio on the air and indicate your support for this show by making a pledge right now. Your gift of $25 or more gives you voting rights at the WAIF annual meeting and the WAIF Alert newsletter. Please call 513-961-8900 or 513-749-1444 right now to make a pledge. You can also pledge online using PayPal by clicking the Donate button on our website, www.waif883.org. If you pledge online, please indicate the name of the show you're supporting in the comments section so they get credit. Each show on WAIF has a minimum pledge level to meet, and you can help them reach that goal. Call now, 961-8900 or 749-1444 or waif883.org and make your pledge of $25 or more to become a member of listener-supported radio WAIF Cincinnati. Thank you. Bring out your date!
about the environment. Hey, I am very passionate about the planet. Say global warming is a myth. It's a myth. Further study is needed. Whoa! That's for selling out your beliefs. <laughs>
These people are hippies. They are occupying a piece of ground in San Francisco's Golden Gate Park, which has come to be called Hippie Hill. They represent a new form of social rebellion. They dress in bizarre and colorful ways. They wear their hair long. Their very name suggests that they are hip, on to something good. They all declare themselves rebels against our society. They like music. The word love is used by them a lot. Oh, I thought he'd call it black. 
Thank you for tuning in to listener-supported WAIF Radio. We're in the middle of our fall member-thon. Help keep WAIF Radio on the air and indicate your support for this show by making a pledge right now. Your gift of $25 or more gives you voting rights at the WAIF annual meeting and the WAIF Alert newsletter. Please call 513-961-8900 or 513-749-1444 right now to make a pledge. You can also pledge online using PayPal by clicking the Donate button on our website, www.waif883.org. If you pledge online, please indicate the name of the show you're supporting in the comments section so they get credit. Each show on WAVE has a minimum pledge level to meet, and you can help them reach that goal. Call now, 961-8900 or 749-1444 or waif883.org and make your pledge of $25 or more to become a member of listener-supported radio WAIF Cincinnati. Thank you. We hope you guys become members this evening. WAIF's website, great spot. If you have more than $25, we'll take that. If you have less, we'll take that too. We're not proud. Uh, we do have at the $150 level a uh, brick, an engraved brick you can put in front of our WAIF complex here in our plaza. And it'll be memorialized forever up here. Uh, real cool. So, yeah, $150. Also, uh, Jesse wanted me to remind you guys that at that level, you get to be DJ for a day. Come in here with Taper Jesse and Ramblin', Ramblin Rob. Uh, make up a playlist. Play it on the radio. Get to yak a little bit on the air. And uh, we'll upload that to YouTube so uh, you can share it with everybody, too. So, um, Well, we're going to get on with a couple more bits of music I have in my uh, hot little hand here, the Strange Mechanics new album. Uh, and we're going to be highlighting here in about 10 minutes or so. We're going to touch base with these guys. Highlight a couple tunes off the album. You guys might recognize the name. They've been in the uh, studio a couple times with me. One of the uh, better bands in Cincinnati. Always a hoot to have these guys in here. A bunch of talented musicians. Okay, well, um, we always try to play some contemporary things here. No, not really. But uh, we, we do try to... Uh, uh, Mix it up a little bit. Uh, tonight we got some Jack Cassidy, some Hot Tuna a little bit later. And uh, I, I haven't seen the new Star Wars movie, and this is how banned it was. I had it in my possession for four days, and I didn't watch it because I was too busy. But anyway, we're going to play this next tune because, uh, hey, Guy, see you later, man. We're going to play this next tune for Guy. So, uh, no. <laughs> Since he's such a big Star Wars fan, yeah, he looks like he looks like he's probably about that age where he might have seen it in the theater in May or something, 1977. But uh, anyway, uh, find Ramblin' Rob on Facebook. I'll become your friend, let you know what's happening here. we got a lot of great guests coming in studio. If you know of a band or are even in a band and would like to maybe pop in here and share your sound with Cincinnati, uh, get a hold of Ramblin' Rob on Facebook. Uh, we got slots, I believe, in December open right now. We're going to close out the year with a couple more acts that we have uh, room for um and then um youtube has about 200 old shows you guys can check that out always excited to uh get to, i think i just uh, uh just a shade shy of 12,000 views on youtube so you guys want to go there push it up to uh 12,000 i like you and love you long time okay well that being said uh we're going to devote this next tune to a uh, guy if you guys like surf music you'll love this next tune that does not even do the surf music. It's not the east or the west side. No, it's not. It's not the north or the south side. No, it's not. It's the dark side. You are correct. Get from the empire to all you beta haters out there. We'll blow your planet up. What does thy mini my master? It's a disaster, Skywalker, what after? What if he can be turned to the dark side? Yes, he'd be a powerful ally, another dark Jedi. He will join us or die. We got Death Star, 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 we got Death Star. I just want 
watch the X-ray rash. Yo, then, why you being a player hater? You know that I still must confront Lord Vader. But Luke, not bringing your here. But there's a city in the clouds where they're keeping my crew. A Jedi's gotta do what a Jedi's gotta do. So now, Vader, I'm coming for you. Yeah, that's right, R2. I just set a new course. We're going to Cloud City. Mighty good gin and tonic, she makes me up another. Things about to get ugly. Impressive, now release your anger. You must have sensed that your friends are in danger. Oh, why'd you slice off my hand? It's imperative that you understand. Oh, be but never bother. Tell me too about your father. He told me enough. He told me you killed him. Then there's something I must reveal. Then I'm your father. 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 Knock him out the box, Luke. Knock him out. Knock him out the box, Luke. Knock him out. Knock him out the box, Luke. Knock him out. Knock him out the box, Luke. Knock him out. Knock him out the box. If I were to ask you what your philosophy of life or your creed, what would that be? Have a good time all the time. That's my philosophy, Marty. <laughs> Come on in, pull the coat. 
Okay, that was the Grateful Dead, of course. A little greatest story ever told. Uh, in case you guys missed it, we got a uh, good morning little schoolgirl from 1969 out the Hilton Hotel, San Fran to kick it off. 1972, Big Railroad Blues from the Empire Pool up in London, England from the Europe 72 tour. And another one more Saturday night, another one from the Europe 72 tour for 26 at the 100-year hall. Y'all are 100 year hall. Uh, that was a great... Uh, Three disc thing. Oh well. Anyway, we are uh, live in studio. We've got a couple guys from the Strange Mechanics in here. Thank you uh, very much for joining us uh, tonight. Appreciate that. Thank you, Rob. Oh, no problem. No problem. Uh, I, uh, I'll let you guys uh, introduce yourselves and uh, tell everybody uh, what you do in the band, as far as what instruments you play, and also tell us who is not here, so we know who's in the band. Uh, yeah, my name's Bobby. Uh, I play the guitar and I sing in Strange Mechanics. And the guys who are here tonight are myself and Brian Johnson. Brian Johnson plays the bass. Hello. And, and uh, the guys who are not here tonight are uh, Tyler Magnarini, who is a great name around town. He used to play in ski tones. And uh, also Rory Cooper, who also plays in Etho Sign, another local band. Mm -hmm. And then Mikas Davis plays the drums um yeah so yeah you've got your first album in your hand um I, I guess it was an enjoyable experience overall doing the album oh yeah definitely a lot of fun took a long time but glad to be done with it and, uh, <laughs> kitty cats are in the way it's a lot of work it's good to have it done so how long did it take it from the very first from very first i guess conception of album to a final pressing and you got one in your actual hand uh that's Probably about nine, close to nine months. Really? Yeah. Wow. That's a long time. That's a long but, time. But, I mean, yeah. that's balancing it with, like, playing shows well, and everything. Yeah. So it wasn't, like, nine months of constant in studio. work. Like, every day in the studio. Mm. It was on and off, I guess. A lot of hours. Playing. And you guys recorded in Cincinnati? Yes, we did. So, well, we recorded stuff at Soap Floats in Cincinnati mm -hmm. with uh, Ben Cochran. And then... Uh, we had Chris Schmidt mix and mastered it, who's done a lot of stuff around town. Gotcha, it's gotcha. Well, we'll find out here in a minute how good a, he, a job he did. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Hopefully you guys also think that yeah. after hearing it. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, yeah, Rob, for having us on here and letting us play a couple tracks. Oh, yeah, it's my pleasure, man. I, I really, uh, out of all the artists I have in, you guys generate a lot of comments. And as far as uh, people enjoying what they heard, so, yeah, always welcome here at WAIF, and especially on Ramblin' Rob's show. I mean, just don't get burst into a gospel show and say, we're here! Yeah, <laughs> we'll try to, uh, you know, avoid the <coughs> temptation there. But uh, So you guys have a, an album out. Um, what, I guess, uh, since it's your first album, what did you, I guess, take away? I mean, what did you guys think your most important lesson learned during the very first album was? Uh, well, we have actually done a, a short EP. Well, see, I don't have that. <laughs> which was called uh, to get it to you. what was that one called again Brian? Circles yeah so Circles gotcha. and uh, that was actually for Brian's senior project when he was finishing up his degree ah. so this is our second experience working and initially that was supposed to be an LP we wanted to have that be full length but you know, when you start doing these things, you find out there's a lot more to it. When uh -huh. you when you when you want to be an artist about it and you want things a certain way, uh, it takes a lot of guess and check and a lot of revision. You know, I've heard, I've heard. Yeah, I talked to a lot of guys. Sixty-one percent of the people in here are working on an album at some stage, beginning, starting, editing, printing. Seems like everybody's working on an album, which is good. You know, I mean, that's the best way to get your music out there. Mm. So, say you know, some listeners might have might hear something they like and hear in a little bit. Um, where could they pick this thing up at? Well, it will be officially released tomorrow night at Madison Live. We're having a show with Paradoni. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. uh, the show will start about 10. We'll go on around midnight. We'll have them for sale there. But it will also be soon available on iTunes. And it will be on Spotify. And oh, gotcha. Among a bunch of other websites online that you'll be able to purchase it. But also, if you ever come out and see us, you can get a physical one for sure. And... Mm -hmm. Also see a pretty awesome show, probably. Pretty, yeah, exactly. <laughs> maybe, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Depends if on the you night. stay, maybe you're just coming for the album. Oh, I'm sure. Yeah. <laughs> hey, some people. I've I found some really good bands just kind of stumbling into places and like not even knowing. 
You know, I, I I was down watching an Orange Bowl in Florida one time and just kind of stumbled in this bar next door, like at 11 o'clock, and whoever this dude was playing, he looked, I mean, spot on Jerry Garcia. Yeah. I mean, me being a – I even had to look like two or three times just real close, like, <laughs> God, this guy is spot on, same glasses, he had black T-shirt, I mean, just dead on him. And they were rocking, man. I don't know what they were calling, but anyway. Um, we're going to be featuring a track number, let's see, three here, I guess, off the album first? Yes, Cirque yeah. de Strange is – the title track yeah you guys can google that i'm sure and, and yeah. find this thing so uh and this is the title track off the album so the same thing you guys didn't do the bad company thing yet have you, you have not like, yet no not yet rambling rob you should <laughs> <laughs> have a song called strange mechanics off the I album i think i'm just calling it brian johnson name it about me <laughs> well see you could yeah <laughs> you could <laughs> all right well uh, let's get on with this first track it did Let's see here. Oh, yeah, it's not too long. Mm -hmm. it's, it's only like five minutes. So, yeah, we might even uh, get on with a, a couple more tracks from this. Uh, and then we're going to get back with the Strange Mechanics and touch touch base with them about uh, where they're going to be this year and also uh, hopefully um, what they're doing, if they have an idea. We'll find out. <laughs>
All right, that's what you call a tasty little nugget there off Strange Mechanics' first or second album, I guess. <laughs> first full length. First full length yes, album. Sir. That was track number three, and uh, we're going to be listening to a couple more tunes here uh, in just a second. But first, I, I know you guys have a release party scheduled sometime in the immediate future. Is that yeah, correct? Yeah, it's um, April 15th. That, that is tomorrow. Oh, my God, that's tomorrow. Yeah, it's coming up quick, the Ides of April here. <laughs> oh, and, yeah. Uh, and so we got 200 confirmed at least. You know, 250, 300 people are going to be there. Oh, nice. Really good, good folks. Uh Good little Cincinnati crew. Essential Productions putting the show on. They do a wonderful job. And, uh, and where's it going to be at? That's at the Madison Live. It's next door to the Madison Theater. It's owned by the same folks. And gotcha. They're, they're going to be doing a lot of more joint shows between those two venues, so look for that. Oh, in the that's future. good. Yeah. That's good. Yeah, well, that's good. I, always always a good thing to have another venue for live music in Cincinnati because yeah. there's, a, there's a lot of places you can hear live music in Cincinnati, but not a lot of cool places to hear. Covington. Live. Covington's awesome. Yeah, that place right. has a rooftop stage too now, which oh, is pretty yeah? cool. Yeah, mm-hmm. and it's like the smoking area whenever there's shows at the Madison now, but like, oh, yeah, okay. I don't know how much they've utilized it, but it's they got a bar. They got a bar on spot. the roof, maybe? Yep, they have a bar yeah. upstairs. Uh, it's nice. very nice. Yeah, well, that sounds classy. They could have too three. classy for Cincinnati. That's why it's in Kentucky. Right? They could <laughs> potentially, yeah, they could potentially have three bands playing there at the same time. One really? in the Madison Theater, one in the oh, Madison yeah. Live, and one on the rooftop. There's actually two hallways that connect the Madison Live to the Madison Theater, like nice thoroughfare, yeah, the thoroughfares, inside. covered thoroughfares on the inside. Yeah, mm, um, so you can get out of the weather, weather, and no, no, you uh, can go right in from one venue right into the other venue. They they connect with doors. Doors. Wow, that's doors. pretty neat. Yeah, it's like when you get a hotel room and there's a door that, you know, there's, dou- there's weird double doors where there'd be a door and then you open it, there's another door. They don't have a lot of those anymore, do they? I don't know, man. I don't, I don't travel a lot. <laughs> <laughs> well, if this new album takes off, you might. <laughs> I, that's what we're hoping for, man. I want to find out, do some double door research. <laughs> All right, so you guys need to, to get this album so he can do his double door research across finer and lesser hotels and motels across America. All hey, right, man. well. <laughs> So we've got uh, another tune here we're going to slide into. What's this next one? Slide into the groove. Slide into this groove. That's right. Slide into this groove. So how did you guys come up uh, with the title? Uh, well, this particular one was actually written by our drummer's dad. Really? Maurice yeah, Davis. Yeah, I think he wrote it a while ago. Young but, uh, Davis, if you're out there listening. Yeah, he would. He better be. It's, he said he would like if we played it, and Mikas, the drummer, wanted to play it, and it's cool jam, so and we kind of... Said yeah. Have essentially, I guess, made it our own. We always paid where credit where credit is due, but I guess you could say. Did you put your own twist on it? I guess. Yeah. A little bit. Yeah. Well, that's good. But Mikas, when he was a teenager, did the sound engineering, the recording, for his dad's band at the time, recording this song. So Mikas, this is one of the earliest things that he did with with engineering. Then he went on to engineering school and got his degree on sound engineering. Oh, gotcha. So, you know. That's why you guys had so much equipment. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you got a sound engineer in the band. Yeah. <laughs> we push it. We push it, man. And he's the drummer, so he's got a lot of gear. Yeah, drummers drummers do have a lot of gear. I, they will say, But, I mean, on the flip side of that, at least you don't have to carry all that stuff if you're not a drummer. Yeah, unless you're nice. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, a lot of times, you know, they take different vehicles to the shows. So you don't have to deal with whole drum set. That's like right. That. You just kind of look the other way when they're That's loaded, right. man. I'm loaded out, man. Hurry up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so this is an oldie but a goodie, then, I guess we can call it, huh? Yes, sir. All right, well, let's listen to this one. Uh, in case you guys like it, you can check out Strange Mechanics down at the uh, the Madison, uh, what, was it, what do they call it exactly? The Madison, Madison Live. Live. That's right. Right next door. So uh, without much further ado, uh, another track from Strange Mechanics. <laughs> In just a second. I forgot to do the uh, ever famous slide into the groove, groove finger. Grind with me, uh, uh, baby, grind with me. Slide with me, let's slide into this groove. As we slip into this groove, let the music do what it has to do. Let the beat take hold of you. Let the melody make everything cool. Release your mind. Your soul, release your body. I'll take control. Let's make everything warm. That's cold. Let's make it hot way down below. Let's make 
thank you for tuning in to listener-supported WAIF Radio. We're in the middle of our fall member-thon. Help keep WAIF Radio on the air and indicate your support for this show by making a pledge right now. Your gift of $25 or more gives you voting rights at the WAIF annual meeting and the WAIF Alert newsletter. Please call 513-961-8900 or 513-749-1444 right now to make a pledge. You can also pledge online using PayPal by clicking the Donate button on our website, www.waif883.org. If you pledge online, please indicate the name of the show you're supporting in the comments section so they get credit. Each show on WAIF has a minimum pledge level to meet, and you can help them reach that goal. Call now, 961-8900 or 749-1444 or waif883.org and make your pledge of $25 or more to become a member of listener-supported radio WAIF Cincinnati. Thank you. Do it, people. Become members. And if you become a member tonight at the $150 level, you get an engraved brick. Yes, engraved with whatever you want on it right here in front of our studios here at WAIF. And also, you'll be DJ for a day. Come in with Taper, Jesse, and myself. Pick a playlist. We'll spin it on air and record it and upload it to YouTube so your grandkids can laugh at you. So, uh, yeah, we have been featuring multiple tracks from Strange Mechanics' new album tonight, and they are in studio. I thank you again for joining me, guys. I had a good time listening to the uh, tune so far. I'm impressed. Well, thanks for letting us play them on your station. Oh, no mm-hmm. problem. Mm-hmm. No problem. Always, always willing to do about anything for the uh, local bands. I always try to feature some great local acts, and honestly, probably some not great local acts, but you guys are one of the good ones, so yeah, I'm always happy to get you guys in here. We believe you. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't have had you in twice if I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, we've got another uh, couple tracks from the album coming up, and I'll let you guys introduce those here, those next two tracks we're going to be featuring. Yeah, this first one is called simply Groove. Groove? Okay, well that sounds good. And the next one we'll be listening to will be which one? Uh, that'll be Plight of Samson. Oh, there you go. Plight of Samson. Is so that- Groove, and then we got Plight of Samson. Those are track numbers 5 and 10 of the album and the album is called Cirque Day Strange in case anyone was wondering yeah and it's got a cool uh, I like the album cover and the artwork on the inside it's pretty funky man yeah, I will say that done by a couple of our friends Davey Howard and Vince DiBiaso they're local artists they painted a lot of the shows that Essential Productions throws and around the area and uh yeah, they're very talented. Mm-hmm. Kind of trippy, man. I will say that. Kind of trippy. Yeah, a little strange. Kind of freaks me out if I look at it long enough. <laughs> <laughs> it is staring at me right now, as a matter of fact. Yeah, set it up that way. We, we, we set it up that way to freak you out, man. Sorry. <laughs> All right, well, this is Groove off that new album. You guys can uh, check it out uh, online. Just type in Strange Mechanics. You can get it in your hot little hands live tomorrow down at the... Uh, the Madison Live, or, um, yeah, I was going to say, don't bug them while they're playing tomorrow, but, yeah, I'm sure they'll have a little merch booth set up. You guys got, like, any other merch you're hawking? Uh, we'll probably have some stickers, some hat pins. Stickers, CDs, Probably pens, some copies of the uh, EP, which we haven't had pens that at the merch booth for a long time. Oh, there you yeah. go. Yeah. So uh, you should get it'll away be another chance to get it. We're also auctioning off uh, 18 by 24-inch canvases that are the... Uh, pictures on the album like the cover oh. and then the picture on the cd and they're like big canvases that they were actually painted on so oh that's that's pretty neat those are uh, yeah that's definitely that's definitely a good way to make a little money because that should yeah those are pretty yeah pretty that'll interesting go. that's how we're paying the artists <laughs> <laughs> hey you gotta do what you're gonna do starting out man that's right all right well let's jam out to a little over seven minutes here of a little uh song called groove Thank you. 
All right, thanks again for joining Old Ramblin' Rob here on WAIF. You're listening to The Greatest Story Ever Told. Without Taper Jesse tonight, he, uh, I think, is a little under the weather, so I hope he's uh, sending out some good vibes there to Jesse. hope he's feeling better. I hope uh, he's in next week. I have an exciting show for you. Um, also, um, you guys may want to check out The Strange Mechanics. I'll be uh, popping into Madison Live tomorrow and also be uh, featuring tracks from their new album i am sure and we're going to be featuring one more track from that album here um and this one is a uh, plight of samson uh, in just a second um you can tune in each and every thursday to ramblin rob we do have uh, open slots available waif883.org is where you get information fill out the proposal form become a member and uh maybe we'll get you on the air because that that great spot Right after Old Ramblin' Rob, 10 p.m. to midnight is open. I want to get you sliding in there. So you can find some good stuff to play. Good as well. The Grateful Dead. we got the blues and Grateful Dead on Thursdays. Okay, well, um, we're going to be featuring uh, some more good old Grateful Dead. Right after, uh, fill you guys in on a couple jam band headlines. Um, let's see here. The Rock and Roll Hall of Fame introduces some new members. Uh, NWA, not sure why they're in there. I kind of agree with Gene Simmons. Like, they're rap. They're not rock and roll, and it's a Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Uh, they're probably one of the first entries into the Rap Hall of Fame, in my opinion, for gosh darn sure. But uh, not necessarily the Rock Hall of Fame. It seems odd. 
It seems out of place. Oh, well. Um, let's see. Uh, Cheap Trick. Uh, yeah, they probably shouldn't be there. Um, Chicago. Uh, yeah, great great to see them in there. These are my evaluations. It's my personal opinion. That's why I read a disclaimer, kids. Um, Deep Purple. <laughs> uh, Steve Miller. Probably not. Um, but uh, <laughs> it was great to see him slam bash everybody there. Uh, Michael Franti and Spearhead have a new album coming out. Um, also... Um, Found uh, online a playlist of the last performances of every Grateful Dead song. So just type that in, playlist, last performances, every Grateful Dead tune, and uh, you'd be surprised. Um, Yonder Mountain String Band announced a summer tour. Also, um, let's see, um, a new uh, a new album for two uh, kind of rock legends coming out this summer. Uh, one, Paul Simon, and another, Bob Dylan. So check that out. All right, well, let's get on with some more music here, kids. Uh, like I said, we're going to be playing um, this last uh, track 10, the last song on the album from The Strange Mechanics, playing a Samson. And then uh, when we get back, we got some uh, Grateful Dead, of course. We're going to segue out uh, in 1968. Yeah, we're going back to October 20th, the Greek Theater. Going to be playing uh, most of that show. And then if I get some time, some other surprises. But uh, let's just uh, do a little bit of this.
Egypt. Plight of Samson from Strange Mechanics there. Uh, just a little sneak peek of that first album, or the second first full-length album. I keep calling that because I don't have that very first one that they have. Maybe I'll get that here soon. But, uh, yeah, sneak peek. We played four tracks off that album. I'll be featuring more of that over the next couple weeks and months for sure. Um, and hopefully you got. I'll be out of town, but hopefully you guys will check them out here tomorrow. Find them on Facebook. They got SoundCloud. They got, they got everything. They're high-tech. They're young. They're high-tech, man. Okay, well, um, let's get on with a little music here. I'm going to jump back to the closing of the Fillmore. Uh, since it was, uh, I think, Jack Cassidy's birthday here. Just I missed it. But uh, we're always so contemporary, so we're going to play this tune. Uh, great tune. I really enjoy this tune uh, by Hot Tuna. And uh, I'm sure you all guys are, too.
Thank you for tuning in to listener-supported WAIF Radio. We're in the middle of our fall member-thon. Help keep WAIF Radio on the air and indicate your support for this show by making a pledge right now. Your gift of $25 or more gives you voting rights at the WAIF annual meeting and the WAIF Alert newsletter. Please call 513-961-8900 or 513-749-1444 right now to make a pledge. You can also pledge online using PayPal by clicking the Donate button on our website, www.waif883.org. If you pledge online, please indicate the name of the show you're supporting in the comments section so they get credit. Each show on WAIF has a minimum pledge level to meet, and you can help them reach that goal. Call now, 961-8900 or 749-1444 or waif883.org and make your pledge of $25 or more to become a member of listener-supported radio WAIF Cincinnati. Thank you. Yeah, thanks, guys. Appreciate all the people who have helped Ramblin' Rob stay on the air in the past. Hope you guys join this year, too. We are a member-driven uh, radio station. That means we depend on our listening community to support us and keep the lights on, keep the mics on, and keep the best in live Grateful Dead jam bands and regional acts coming. Well, as usual, I'm going to roll out of here with uh, 30 minutes of nonstop music. And as usual, also, I decided to change gears. Instead of going back to d- October 20th, 1968 at the Greek Theater. Uh, we're going to feature a hodgepodge. We're, we're going to feature it one tune. That's uh, the second track from that show. Um, turn on your love light. And then we're going to uh, jump to 1983. And then a little JGB to wrap things up from 1989. Not going to tell you the songs. You guys are just going to have to stick around. So a uh, big shout out to Smokestack Cindy. Also Brian and family, Mary Jo, the kids. Thanks again for supporting Rambler Rob Lyle. And thanks again for uh, writing the best theme song ever. Appreciate that. And also a big shout out to all the internet listeners who are listening. Facebook friends and family. And uh, the unknown crazy people who are listening right now. So, um, let's see. Let's, let's get on with some good old stuff here. Uh, I'm going to go uh, incognito this week. I'm going down under on the DL. I'm going underground. Going away. Far far away to a galaxy like Star Wars or some place weird like this
Thank you for tuning in to listener-supported WAIF Radio. We're in the middle of our fall member-thon. Help keep WAIF Radio on the air and indicate your support for this show by making a pledge right now. Your gift of $25 or more gives you voting rights at the WAIF annual meeting and the WAIF Alert newsletter. Please call 513-961-8900 or 513-749-1444 right now to make a pledge. You can also pledge online using PayPal by clicking the Donate button on our website, www.waif883.org. If you pledge online, please indicate the name of the show you're supporting in the comments section so they get credit. Each show on WAIF has a minimum pledge level to meet, and you can help them reach that goal. Call now, 961-8900 or 749-1444 or waif883.org and make your pledge of $25 or more to become a member of listener-supported radio WAIF Cincinnati. Thank you. Fire it up!
middle of the night And I need you, darling To make things all right So come on, baby Come on, baby Baby, please Baby, please And I'm begging you, baby Baby, 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 baby. Come on my knees On the knees Turn on your light Turn on your light Let it shine on me Let it shine on me Turn on your light Turn on your light Let it shine on me 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 Early in the morning, let it shine on me. Late in the evening, let it shine on me. Come on, darling. You feel pretty good. Yes, it will. Get a little better. Come on, baby. And it's all I need. Because I don't want it all. I just want a little bit. I don't want it all. I just want a little bit. A little your loving, a little your hugging, a little your kissing, a little your ride. That's all I, all I need. My my baby, I feel pretty good. My my baby. Make me feel just a little like talking, and you know that it's got to make me feel a little a bit like a little like falling. My my babe, you feel pretty good. My my babe, you feel alright. Because I've been looking for my for my babe. I've been looking for my for my girl. Well, I'm looking here and there, looking everywhere, looking in the town, looking in the cell, looking for my baby. I just got to, got to, got to find my, my girl. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. Yes, you do.
me with advertisements everywhere and tons of security guards.
It's a shame those boys can't be more copacetic. I meet a West LA girl. Already know what I need. Still a girl Already know what I need to know Name, address, and phone number Lord, it 